Last month marks six years that we've been doing these Price of Freedom stories. We've told the stories of World War II, Korean War, Vietnam War veterans, some who are no longer here with us. We've dug into issues that our veterans are facing today, like the suicide crisis or accessing the benefits they deserve through the VA. But it's also important to remember the families of those who serve. Many times it's the families of our nation's veterans who are left to tell our heroes' stories long after they're gone. Family's important, people are important, and we cannot forget them. Bird Coolidge has made three trips to Europe. His daughter Cindy has been with him the last two times. While there, we went to the Normandy Cemetery. We honored my husband's cousin, second cousin. His name was Emmett Floyd Waltman. Cindy Coolidge's grandfather served in World War II. We went to the 90th anniversary of the end of World War I. That is where my great great uncle Carl Llewellyn Coolidge was killed November 1st, 1918. They made the trip in 2008 and again a few months ago. The most moving moment was when they pay, played taps and dad, I caught dad with his hand across his heart and that is the moment that hit me the most. They visited spots all around Europe, from the beaches of Normandy, places where the Battle of the Bulge was fought, and the site of the Meuse-Argonne Offensive in World War I. Which uh, was the largest and most costly battle, basically, in American history. It was the place where Cindy's great uncle Carl fought and was killed. Historically, it was also the battle where Tennessee's Alvin C. York captured 132 German prisoners. York was later awarded the Medal of Honor for his actions that day. On their trip to Europe, they visited the battlefields where young American soldiers fought and died and the cemeteries where they were laid to rest. 15,000 graves, my guess is, 90% of them have never had a relative visit, mm -hmm. you know. So if we were in any way a stand-in for somebody, and well, we I think that was terrific. Cindy's great-great-uncle Carl L. Coolidge fought in the 314th Infantry Regiment, 79th Division in World War I.